There's a full moon tonight. A rather powerful one at that. So powerful, in fact, that all the sun's brilliance has been blocked out by its dark brother. people and welcome to a brand new episode of a brand new series uh a, a part of a series actually a gaming series sorry that was my table called shadow wolf mysteries and this one is the second uh installment of the series bane of the family collector's edition because i like doing collector's editions um i was gonna say you might remember the last game we played but that would be a lie because I was playing the first game of the series, uh, Curse of the Full Moon, and the game glitched, and I could got a net egg, and I could not go any further. So we didn't finish it. But if you guys are interested in figuring out the ending of the game, the first game, then I suggest you look up other videos on YouTube and watch them to see what happens or buy the game yourself it's an amazing game you can find it on Big Fish as well as uh, this game here the second one and the other games which I will eventually get to hopefully if the games don't glitch out on me um yeah uh, what do I want to say about this game it's about werewolves, clearly. It was confirmed in the last game that they are werewolves. I just spoiled it for you. I'm sorry if you were looking forward to figuring out what was going on in the first game. I spoiled it for you. If not, woo. Um, I surely had things I wanted to say about this video, and I forgot, as is my usual. But, warnings. Uh, this game is about werewolves. I There's a little bit of creepy scare factor in it, I think. Not very much, as far as I remember. I have played this before, but again, it was a long time ago. So I probably don't remember anything. Aside from there is a carriage with a girl in it, maybe? That's all I know. And I'm pretty sure that's like the opening of the game, so that doesn't help at all. Um, what else? Warning number two, I do curse, and I do swear, which is the same thing. So if you don't like that, uh, go watch another video or mute me. If you're okay with it, welcome to the video! I don't know what else to say, so we're just gonna switch over my capture and get into this game. Because I'm excited, because I really love these games. These and the Dark Parable series, which I will record at some point probably after this or something are amazing games so without further ado I'm gonna just switch over my capture and I will see you in game people Well, that was pretty badass. Um. Okay. There we go. I knew that was a loading screen because I loaded it up enough to get the opening for stuff. New profile. So, whoa. Gosh, as always. And the wolf looks a lot better in this series. And it is pissed off at me. So we're gonna turn this down. Because, yeah, it's loud. How is that music? That's noise more than anything. Let's see, full screen customers. Okay. I'm assuming this level is okay. This wolf is just pissed off at me because I scrolled over. 
extras. What extras? We have music tracks we can unlock. We got concept art. I shouldn't look at that. This wallpaper is freaky. Screen saved. Okay, so... Yeah. We'll look at that later after the game. I shouldn't have looked at it now. Um... Where Credits. Okay, Shadow Wolf Mysteries Curse of the Full Moon is the first game. Oh, there is a strategy guide in here. Awesome. And... As I've said, there was a glitch with my game that uh, allowed me not to pick up an axe I needed to actually move on to the next scene where I would do things and stuff. I don't know what because I didn't get that far. But if you want to see what happens in the game, you'll have to look it up on YouTube somewhere else or get the game yourself as I said. It's on Big Fish and Big Fish always has sales and stuff so that's cool. I actually checked it today and... As of August 13th, I think it is, yeah, there is a 50% off all game sale, so you can look forward to that if you get it today, or whatever. It's probably This is probably going to come out tomorrow, so that was a stupid, yeah. Um, I'm going to check the levels on this and I will be right back, people, okay? So just one second and then we can seriously start the game. Alright people, I'm back, and we are ready to begin. In regular mode, because I'm not that great at this. There's a full moon tonight. A rather powerful one at that. So powerful, in fact, that all the sun's brilliance has been blocked out by its dark brother. They did improve the wolf and the howl from last game. The last game just sounded strange when it howled. This time though, the wolf looks like it has fur on it and not like a hairless weird thing. Uh, no. I don't think there's achievements, so just no. There is no lock on the inventory. Strategy guide in game. That's nice. Hopefully I won't use it. There's a note. We'll get to this in a second. I think I clicked on it. There is, however, a wolf. Thank you, oh. Detective, for scaring away that awful wolf. I don't know what would have happened to us if you hadn't arrived. Apparently, they still jump at you, though. Like, Gerard was a nuisance to me, and he kept popping up and scaring me because there was no warning. He was just there, like these people. I didn't even get to click on the door. I clicked on the wolf. And if you don't know, this is Luis from game one and the daughter who wanted the trap in front of her bed. So, yeah. And she looks really weird in the mirror. Veronica is my adopted daughter, and she is very ill. But what she has is no ordinary disease. Is it lycanthropy? That's why we're here. As you probably know, this is the home of Count de la Fere, Veronica's real father. For what ails my poor little girl, only the Count has the cure. Okay. Please, take this medallion and give it to the Count. He'll understand everything. You're giving me the medallion again? <sighs> Please find him. We'd come with you, but I'm afraid to leave the carriage with that wolf out there. I just scared it off. Lady. I feel like this isn't loud enough now. She was so quiet. Hopefully that doesn't blast you out of there. Okay. So again, we have the medallion. Ooh. And a big ass knife. Count, your efforts are fut fut futile. You're chasing after the wind. No matter where you hide her or what you do, Veronica will not escape what she is. I will see to it personally. 
with all my heart, hatred, your wife, Count de la Fier. What? Uh, Veronica's grandmother wants to do something to her? I'm pretty sure I know what's going on, by the way. If I had a knife, I could open the package without damaging the contents. Dude, it's just wrapping paper in a ribbon. How can you not... Uh, totally the present I wanted. Okay, now let's... Uh... See, it's talking about an encounter, but I have not seen this yet, so I don't know if I messed up or not. Anyway, chance encounter. I recently met the man they call Count de la Fier, a man I saw turn into a werewolf right before my eyes in my previous event. Oh, this is from last game. That's why I'm confused. Okay. So apparently the, uh, there are spoilers in this game as well. I'm sorry, people. I did not know this. After I regained my senses, I followed him to his... Palatal country estate, where he leapt over a massive wrought iron fence and disappeared inside. But I'm told werewolves turn back into mere men when coming... when the coming of the sun. So... I wait for morning before I approach him. Okay. Uh, crossing paths. Once past the gate, I found a woman and her child being harassed by a wolf. After seeing it away, scaring it away. I can't read today. Scaring it away. I peeked inside to find Luis, the woman I saved the day before. So this investigation is taking place the day after the last game? That's interesting. Uh, I found her at her wit's end, clutching her daughter, Veronica, whom I also had just met while searching for her mother. We shared with me that Veronica has fallen ill, and for whatever plagues her, only Count the Count has the cure. Fearing a return of the wolf, I told Luis that I, I'd venture inside the De, De La Fure estate and speak out to the Count and his, person, and his cure personally. personally. Jeez, I'm worse at talking today than I have been in a while. Dire threats. A letter in the Count's mailbox paints a disturbing picture. It seems that Louise is the only is only Veronica's adopted mother, and that her real mother has other plans for little Veronica. And what is this talk about Veronica? About what Veronica really is? I need to speak with the Count right away. Oh. So this, uh, threatening letter was actually from Veronica's real mother. I thought it was, like, his- her grandmother or something. Like, she had a fling with the Count, and the the lady in the thing is extra jealous. Oh, jeez. Slightly startled me. Hi, horsey. I have no reason to harness this horse yet. Perhaps I'll come back later. Without a wheel, this coach will not move. Uh, I need to find a wheel if I want to get that. Okay. Whatever. Come on. Uh, oh, did I get a note, by the way? Also, why is my book so, like, fangy? This is weird. Off werewolf man. Uh, what or who could have leave claw marks like this, dude? After seeing a werewolf, you still wonder what happened. I don't know. I can't loosen these screws with my bare hands. Oh, oh, God! There's a person here. Was this dead body here before, or am I that blind? Uh, thank you. What's this? Dear Count, seven years ago you blessed me with the chance of watching over your daughter, Veronica, in the hopes that being raised by a normal human would benefit her. But last night's full moon confirmed my greatest fears. Our, her change has begun. 
Unless something is done soon, the curse of your bloodline will continue in her. I brought Veronica here to your estate, but I've become trapped inside my carriage after a wolf attacked us. I'm sending our coachman in my, st in my stead to seek your aid. I ask, no, beg you to finish the work Meh. on your cure quickly so that Veronica never has to know what she is. Sincerely, Sincerely Louise. So Veronica is a werewolf. That's what I thought. The messenger. It seems I am the, not the first one who has tried to contact the Count on behalf of Louise and Veronica. But who did this to the poor coachman? Did it appear? That wolf? Or so someone or something else? I'll have to be careful so that I do not end up like this unfortunate soul. Oh. I missed one. Mysterious door. There's a lot of reading in this. As I closed in on the De La Fure estate, I came across a side entrance that looked promising. But as I approached it, a pair of blood-red eyes locked with mine. It made the hair on my neck stand up, and just as quickly as they appeared, they vanished into the darkness. Regardless of the danger, I have to find a way inside. Veronica's life depends on it. Okay. There's a stick. Can I smack the wolf in the eye? And a torch. Um... I was thinking something, and then I forgot what it was. Oh. Oh. Uh... Okay, just rip the decor off. Um, okay, I'm just gonna... First hidden object scene. Uh, like last time, there are hidden things. But when you find them, they turn normal. That's interesting. Glass of wine, of Uh, Charlemagne. Sh the chamomile. Uh, why is it Charlemagne? It's chamomile. Which is. I know what chamomile is, but I can't think of what it looks like. Isn't it a plant? Okay, now there's music and it might be too loud, but I don't know for sure. Hopefully you guys can still hear me. If not, I will have to turn it down next episode. But we're still on this one, so deal with it. Alright, anyway. Here's the... Oh, I don't get the idol? That's crap. Um, okay, I need to find stuff, seriously. Bone, plug, and deer. There's the bone. anything. I'm blind. Scarecrow, cherries, and pincers. There's pincers. That's a scarecrow. Cherries are here. Coffee mill was up here. Uh, the lamp is here and the funnel was... Oh, come on. I know where the funnel is. There. Alright, so now I need a clog, a deer, and chamomile. Oh, clogs of shoes. Duh. I couldn't figure out what a clog was. A deer and chamomile, which I don't. There's the deer. Chamomile would be... No. A... I'm sure you guys know what chamomile is and you're looking at it and you're like, It's right there, idiot! Well, I don't remember. Aha! It was the flower. I got a scarecrow. Why I need a scarecrow, I don't know yet. There is a deer. I believe this was the coachman that brought Louise here. What did what did this to him? Probably a wolf. Let's advance. Oh, it's it's it knows how to shut doors apparently. Oh. It looks like this door will open with the help of a strangely shaped key. Okay, I'll get that in a second. I just want to look around. Uh, shoe crows, annoying birds. I need a way to scare these crows so I can take this object. 
Uh, I need to lower this branch so I don't break the pumpkin. Stick. No. Are you serious? It was so easy, just... Eh. Dang it. Guess that's not gonna happen. What's this? I need something to untwist these wires. You can untwist wires by hand, man. I've done it myself. Okay. Ladder! Awesome. Uh, okay. Let's just go in here. It seems the only option. Whoopee. It's gone. What? Oh my. Uh, there is, there is an oil-like smell coming from inside this barrel. I wonder what's inside this barrel. You just said you know what's inside this barrel. If I roll this barrel down the stairs, I might crack it open. So stick, lever. That didn't crack. Oh, I guess it did. All right. It's lamp oil. I just, I don't have anything for a lamp. Oh, I just pulled out a coffin by myself. Oh, I need to find the missing part of this mechanism. I bet this is the thing on that gravestone. I hope I'm not going too fast for you guys. Um. Oh! Oh! Oh god, that scared me. That scared me really badly, and I have the lights on. That also looked like the wolf from the opening the, the, the blonde lady turned into. Uh, I don't... I feel as if I've been living in my library these past many years. I have pour poured over texts... Ah! My throat's dry. Ah, uh, I've poured over text looking for a cure to my curse, but my progress is slowed but with every full moon. The longer I remain what I am, the more I lose my grasp on my humanity. If I cannot find a de definite cure soon, I fear all my hope will be lost for myself and my family. Aw, the Count's afraid that he will be more beast than man one day. Okay. Elusive curse. It seems that the Count has been looking for a cure to his condition for some time, but has not yet found one. I know now that he is were a werewolf, and but his letter mentions his family. Does this mean Veronica? Or does he mean Veronica? Yes. Oh my gosh. What a weird picture! And she's human! This is a joke, right? Interesting that the parents in the picture are depicted as werewolves, but not the child. What in the world is this? A werewolf family portrait? That, and the second comment he made was right. They're werewolves, but she's human. Why? Oh, this picture is so weird. I can't stop looking at it. Oh. I could set something on fire here. Oh, I have a torch. Oh. Okay, so I need to soak it in oil first. <sighs> that wouldn't do shit, but okay. Then I can light it. <sighs> okay. Yay. So where do I put it? I don't understand how that wolf left. This is like the only thing in here. Um. Oh, I have a ladder. No, I have to pull it down. I can't put a ladder there, get it, and come down. Are you serious? Stupid thing. Uh. Oh, I can put it here. Shh. The crows aren't afraid of a scarecrow without a head. Jerk faces. Um. I guess I just go back? Was there a reason I needed a ladder? No. Um. 
Luis? Please hurry, detective. You must find the count. All right, all right. I can't invest. Oh, I can't investigate a little bit. A step ladder would work here. Oh. Okay. Because apparently we've become extremely short. All right. Let's. Um. There we go. Earrings. Hi, animated bird. Noose. I tied a noose. I'm skilled. Uh, you're annoying. Shut up. Oh, I can click on the bird. Yay! Uh, yay! Okay, there's a buckle. A weasel is over here outside. Stamp. No, not a stamp. Okay, that's a card. Okay, flute, fox, letter, peas. Oh god, there's a spider. I hate spiders! Flute, fox, letter, peas. There's a letter. There's a fox. Uh, there's a flute. And here's peas. Stamp, dragonfly, and compass. Where's the dragonfly on that? Oh. Is this- yeah, that's the compass. That's not the compass I was thinking of. Oh, this is a stamp. It's an oldie stamp that you put on- Why do I need a noose? Oh! Could this be to pull down the branch? It's a bit morbid, but it might work. Not what I want. This. Oh well. Interesting. And I apparently tied it to its own root. Okay. Go where it crows. Ha ha! And I just pried that off, okay? Let's go... Here. Oh no, help. Rotate the rings by clicking on them so that the images on both discs match. I gotta make them similar. I hate this. Okay. Ah, oh, so close. I've done this before, I know I have. Sorry, I didn't mean to break like that. They have to be the Cobra, it's the only way, but... There is one key in a coffin. Oh, it's a screwdriver. That is the weirdest screwdriver ever. But I can use it on this door. need to rotate the gear to open this door. <sighs> but there's a wolf in there. No. I refuse. I refuse. Um, watering can, mushroom, and onions. There's the onions. That's not... That's, that. that's a watering can. Uh, da 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 da. Mushrooms. Where are mushrooms? Too much? Oh, there's one. 
broom and a mallet. That's a broom, that's a mallet. Uh, chain is here. Plum, corn, and idol. Well, the idol's there. Corn's up here. That's a plum. I feel like the music is loud. Clover, comb, and letter. I gotta figure out where they are. Huh. There's a letter. There's a comb. And where's the clover hidden? Oh, the clover is in here too. Barely saw that. Okay, I have an idol. Um, I think I'm gonna end it here, people. So, yeah. Well, next episode we will go in this room and figure out what's going on. Maybe there'll be a werewolf guy there and we'll have a jump scare right off the bat. Don't know. But we will see. I will yawn. And we will do fun things with werewolves and two creepy idols. So I will see you next episode. And enjoy. And comment, rate, subscribe, my little rebels, please. I'd love to hear feedback from you guys. I didn't mean to breathe like that. I'd love to hear feedback from you guys. And good or bad. Uh, it's probably a bunch of bad because, yeah. Uh, yeah, I don't know what to say, so peace, people.